So the On3 Turbo Kit is here for the 335i. Swag. I gotta figure out how to open this thing. Ooh. The box actually came in pretty good. It's like a 64 pound box or something. Yes, it's not light. Ah, oh, oh, fuck. Man. No, no, not the torture. <laughs> Oh my god! No! <laughs> well then. Well, it comes packaged. Let's start from the top. And that, I'm gonna guess, is the way it's good too. That's the two to one. Super nice. Well, one to two downpipe, but ours goes back to one. V band. Super. Dude, that thing is sick. Super clean, super clean. Do wish they didn't use peanuts. Yeah, I hate peanuts. They are freaking awful. What is this? It's nuts. <laughs> Cold side for the so, turbo. I think so. Piece of intercooler piping. Sit. By the way, this is 61 mil on three turbo kit. Uh, N54. It's the T3 flange. Uh, there's all the old block offs and drains, feed line and drain line. So far it's been packaged pretty good. The box wasn't really messed up. Well Tim, you let me down on that one. Almost did. Cutting too much <laughs> Um Customer service was awesome. I actually ordered right online. Uh, I called the sales department. They they set me up and got sent within two days. So yeah, quite awesome. We're out here fighting coronavirus, trying to go fast, and that is nice. Boy, that's beautiful. Cute little V band. So the N54 manifolds are a, a two-piece manifold because the turbos are banked three to three. And this one, the banks are still separate, but they connect. And then they have a, a big wastegate between the two. Uh, so that's gonna be, that's gonna be number four, five, six turbo manifolds. I mean, yeah. see them welds. Them welds are minty. Insane. I mean, the inside of it is even ground down, like butter smooth. Insane quality. Bluetooth sensors for your factory style. Oh man. Got a little flexi hole on this side. Make it easier to put on. Staple. Yeah. <clears throat> Boy. That looks insane. That conjunction's dope. Super nice. Gives you an idea. That's one, two, three. Careful. That flew out of there. <clears throat> Two things came out. 
All right, well, I just went ahead and got the, the air filter they offer for it. Yeah, they gave us a pro tip. Put the air filter on the turbo before installing it. On the man. Because if not, that's a yeah. feeder. That's yeah, you can't, you can't get the turbo. And the drain, feed restrictor. That last box is actually the turbo. Oh, there's two. Oh, there's more. Never mind. Yeah, there's more. I think this is going to be the waste cake. If I had to guess. Pretty cool little box, actually. One, three, four. Yeah, boy. These guys also do a lot of uh, LS turbo stuff. I mean, they do tons of different kits, but this is pretty much what they're known for is their... LS Turbo stuff and their N54 kit. And they have a, uh, what is it, the fastest? Mile per hour. Mile per hour N54 E90 sedan. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, so that's, that's a big ass wastegate. 50 mil on three wastegate. She's got some quality to her. Bandages. Mm -hmm. I'm excited to hear what a external waste gated N54 sounds like in person. It's gonna be pretty gnarly. It's gonna be a lot better than the quiet ones. Oh man. Got a couple more things <clears throat> back here. I think this right here is actually the turbo. Yeah. There's a few things in there. Yeah, I think the other stuff's like a... It's all V-bands. Uh, let's go this way. Turbo side. Uh, well, that gives you an idea. The Journal Baron 61 mil with the CNC billet. 11 blade compressor wheel upgrade. All together, and it's like 120 for the 61 mil and like 190 something for the 11 blade. Honestly, not a bad deal. No. At all. And this style manifold, there's tons of other turbos that fit it. So you have endless options if you run out of power with this one. Pretty good. Learning nice and easy to turn. Boy, that B band. That compressor wheel looks gnarly. Compressor wheel is like almost bigger than the whole turbo. So, turbo comes already loose to where you can actually adjust it. Everything is plugged up. Ready to rock and roll. Got your B band inlet and outlet. Yeah, V band inlet and outlet. That's one that's of the best manifold. parts. That's your downpipe. What is the AR on that? Uh, I honestly don't know. <laughs> I'd have to look it up again. I think it's 0 0.82. It's something pretty, pretty gnarly, but it, it'll definitely do it a lot better than the twins did. Yeah. I'm just ready to hear that 11 blade. I know that thing's gonna be going. Hopefully, school time will be reduced a little bit too. Oh, yeah. Fishing a little bit more. Yeah, there we go. There's all the V bands. Oh, yeah. Couplers. Okay, yeah. Uh, all the couplers needed go to your intercooler. Of course, the outlet pipe. Yeah. Pretty cool. Triple layer couplers. I believe this is going to be the... No? I don't know. Let's open it. Oh, this is the power steering reservoir. They actually used to oh, yeah. the different power steering reservoir because M54 is a common loop. Clean. 
TIG welded aluminum. Oh yeah, let's see. Yeah, let's see them. Fittings are also removable. If you want, you can make any ends. Pretty rad. Honestly, for the price, it's, it's worth it. God, this one thing is not welcome. <laughs> Nailed it. And of course, you got an N54 and you need heat protection. Yeah. Tons of it. And you're gonna be melting valve covers and that's not fun, they're expensive. The, the turbo is really close to the valve cover. And if you, you have an N54, you already know that the factory twins can melt the valve cover and they're, yeah. nowhere, and they're nowhere near it. Yeah, I've done, so. I went through two already. Four, tur four stock turbos and yeah, it's just time to upgrade. So this kit will make easily around 500 horsepower with the settings the car already has. It's going to be retuned on, what's the tuning? Uh, David Shop is going to be doing the tuning. Uh, it's going to be MHD. Um, we're going to do a couple tunes on it. I'm going to have a Go Fast Bits boost controller, a VSRF, seven and a half inch intercooler, got it coming. To replace the one that's on it because the last turbo kind of got chewed up in there a little bit. <laughs> yeah. Uh, pretty gnarly. We'll show you some pictures later. And, uh, yeah, so he's going to tune in on 93 octane first. So just for drivability, I'm going to daily it a little bit. And if I want to go on that on the weekend, I'm going to party. Put her on E40. Turn her up a little bit. Boy. See what she does. We should have some videos up on the install here in the next few days, depending on how things go. Corona. Yeah. yeah. The virus. The package is in. Well, you know, it's recording. We're gonna party. Yeah.